In fact, I am related to President Andrew Jackson. And both my father and my grandfather are 32nd degree Freemasons, sublime princes of the royal secret. And, and like, like I, I said, said I, I was, was invited, invited to, to join, join the Brotherhood, brotherhood but, but I declined. declined. So, when I was a young boy, I had a dream of growing up one day and being a policeman. Because, because I, I hate, hate, hate and, despise and despise evilness. evilness. I can't stand people who tease and people who are bullies. And like most people on earth, I cannot stand a liar and a thief. So I wanted to grow up and make a difference. In fact, I have two uncles that are policemen. And I can tell you, as a professor of Gracie Jiu Jitsu, I also teach police and sheriff officers. And I can tell you, they are good people trying to raise a family just like the rest of us. And just about every officer joins the force because they want to do good. They want to protect and serve. But the question is, who are they protecting and who are they serving? And just like the fake government that wants you to think it's we, the people, the protect and serve is not about protecting and serving the public. It's about protecting and serving the interests of the owners. It's not about protecting the interests of the slaves. Why do you think police were invented? To protect the people, the public, the slaves? No to protect the owners, the greedy bastards. So they sold us a lie and told us capitalism is the way for the American dream to come to reality. But as you see, capitalism is a way to eliminate the competition and take it all for yourself, a monopoly. And that's why we have the US Capitol, which sits in the belly of the beast. And that's why it's called a capital, idol worship. It's called a pyramid scheme, and that's why the top 5% own 90% of all the wealth. And like I said, King Solomon's temple is laid out exactly like Washington, D.C., and where the altar of sacrifice is, is where our state capital is. And that's why the satanic cult has a devil's hole under the United States Capitol. Because, because the Illuminati, the Illuminati loves, loves their, their devil, devil hole, the, the sacrifice, sacrifice pit, pit to, to hell. hell. And that's why we send our children to war, to be burnt offerings to the sun god, Baal. And that's, that's why, why war, war is, is raw, raw backwards. backwards. And now you know why we have a soldier, or a soul dyer, which is one who dies for the sun. And that's why the United States sun die L is actually the bull penis of Baal, the sun god. And that's why the Washington Monument is surrounded by dead soldiers, because Washington DC is a necropolis, which is city of the dead. And Baal gives us our liberties, not our freedom. When a ship docks, a soldier gets liberties, not freedom. And that's why you have to pay bail, or you'll go to jail. Baal, or El, was the supreme god of the Canaanites and the Phoenicians. Which gives us words like Moloch, or Molest, Cannibal. And we get law and order from the ancient Canaanites and the Phoenicians. So they were the rulers of the sea, and this is where we get our maritime admiralty laws, which gives us morality. I suggest you check out The Occult World of Commerce by Jordan Maxwell. And believe it or not, the Phoenicians are the inventors of our alphabet. Almost all modern alphabets come from the Semitic Canaanite Phoenicians, the phonetic alphabet. The Cana Phoenicians were the ones who discovered and perfected trading. But in order to sell and make a profit, you had to put on your selling face because you're a two-faced liar. And that's where we get our word phony from the Phoenicians. And that's why to this very day, we still have the liars and the scammers from the ancient Canaanites and the Phoenicians. And that's why Wall Street has the Bull God L. 
And that's why the capital is in the belly of the beast, which is the Owl. And that's why clocks are always made from the Owl, which is Old Father Time, Saturn L. And that's why he's the Grim Reaper, the Sower, the Sweeper, the Slayer of Time. And that's why Washington, D.C. has his statue. And don't, and don't forget, forget that, that the Israelites, Israelites and the Jews, Jews the, the Hebrews, Hebrews they, they take the religion from, from the ancient Phoenician Canaanites. Canaanites. And that's why we have a Bible, which is the Bi of Bel. Bel is the son of El, and El is the god of the Hebrew Bible. So now you know why the Shroud of Turin shows an image with the Son of Man, who has horns. And that's exactly why Moses has the horns. Because the entire story of the Bible is about sex. And that's why Israel also has the obelisk, which takes its name from Baal, which gives us the symbol. And why do you think it's the red bull? because the Canaanites and the Phoenicians were known as the color of purple or red. Because they made human sacrifices and blood rituals. And we get our word Phoenix from the Phoenicians, which gives us our words fire and fume and pyre. And that's why a person that is obsessed with fire is a pyro, which is the Phoenicians and the Romans. And Catholic means the fire spirit or the phoenix. Because we get the word Catholic from the Carthage caused by the Carthaginians. And that's why the Pope and the Cardinals wear the red cap of death. The same one worn by the Freemasons. And it's called the Red Fez because it's been dipped in blood. And the Red Fez comes from the Red Phoenicians. The word Pope means Father, which is blasphemy because only God is the Father in the Bible. In Revelations we see he wears a robe dipped in blood. And another beast comes up from the earth and he had two horns like a lamb and he spoke like a dragon. And the beast and whore of Babylon will be clothed in purple and scarlet and adorned with gold and precious stones. So now you know why the Pope, who is the father bull, issues a papal bull. And that's why they're holding a bull penis. And that's why the Vatican has the obelisk, the male fertility penis. And the Vatican is laid out exactly like the female uterus. And that's why the penis of Bell is inserted in the mid-L. And the Vatican also has a devil's hole. In fact, we get the word penis and phallus from the Phoenicians. And the Canaanites give us the candel, or the can of L. And that's why churches light the fire fertility of the candles. And now you know why the Catholic Church are pedophiles and have so many sexual abuse cases brought against them. So the ancient Cana Phoenician god L gives us our words elder, elite, and the Roy L's. And that's why churches are known as a temple or a chapel. And the god L gives us our ang -els. The ang of L. And that gives us our word angel. And people think that we have a fallen angel. But really, it's just a fallen angle. Look into astrology and it gives you the answer. The fallen angle. And that's why they tell you one-third of God's angels fell from heaven. Because one-third represents the last fallen angel or angle of the house. And that's why they tell you the angel is the messenger of the gods. Because an angle gives you the message from the gods. Which are the planets. And the astrologer uses the angles in between the planets to give you a reading. And the kings in Egypt were known as pharaohs, the red fire. 
And that's why Egypt has the fertility obelisk and the pyramids. And of course, the phoenix, the rising sun. And that's why all religions of the world worship the sun and the fire. Religion means the legions of the sun god, Re. And that's why the Illuminati use the pyramid and the pyramid.